Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Essence of Shay. Let's get started! Ugh! Happy freaking New Year, y'all! Happy New Year! What? You'll need to know the words to feel the music. Two step little bit of blit. We are in 2017. Your girl still stumbles on her words, but she's still back bringing you smiles to your face. Yeah. So let's get into some housekeeping first. If you haven't already, please click that subscribe button. If you're new to my channel, welcome to the family. Thank you for your love and support. Don't forget to click over those noti that notification button so you will get all my videos. If you would like some hand jewelry, some custom made beaded bracelets, true to your heart, mean, mean for grounding, spirituality, whatever, to give you some motivation, whatever you like, go to Bo Ali Brooklyn. The link is right here. It'll be in the description box below. Purchase your, your braces today and let's get right into the video. Last year, <laughs> last year, I asked you guys to ask me any questions that you guys would want to know from me, anything. So I got the questions right here. I expected a whole lot more, but you know, that's, that's fine. You don't want to pry. I get it. So number one, this is from Malika J. If I say your name wrong, please don't crucify me. I'm bad with names. Everybody says this, so we got to do better. Anyways, she says, please talk about your backgrounds in your videos. I'm always interested to know what room you're in. So right now I am in my grandmother's living room because it gets, it gives me the best natural light and it's like a homey feel. Before I was in my room, Adranita Moultrie Davis, she asks, what city do you live in New York? So I live in Brooklyn, New York. <laughs> Can you show how you wrap your locks? Like do, like what you have in the video? Sure, uh, I, uh, you mean turban wise, um, underscore lock it up asked me that. And I actually have a video where I do turban looks. So I'll put the link right here. Bianca C asks, what is your source of inspiration for your locks? Slash, what is your favorite hobby? So my lock inspiration in the beginning was Lauren Hill. Prior to everything else, like the person who I was with at the time giving me the inspiration to start my locks. I always loved her locks and how free form and effortless it looked. So I love that. My inspiration now, um, I love fun and I can't, ugh, I feel like a jerk because I can't remember anybody's names right now. But there's so much lock inspiration and myself. I mean, I've, I don't want to sound conceited, but I've come a long way with my lock journey and appreciating my locks and the lo the stages that my locks are in right now. So I am my inspiration. I love fun is my inspiration. I love her hair. They're thick. So ask, what is your favorite hobby? I like to read a lot of books. A lot, a lot of books. I love doing creative things like making bracelets, jewelry, um, editing videos. I love traveling. I love, I love anything creative. I love it all. Next question is, where are your family from? My mother's side is from Jamaica. Like the whole of my mother's side is from Jamaica. My dad's side from the people that I do know are from Guyana, the island, not Ghana, but Guyana. And then he said, my dad said, some people there are from Trinidad as well. I personally was raised in the Virgin Islands, St. Croix to be specific. So I have a nice mixture of Caribbean culture and American culture, and which I like and makes me the person that I am right now. Will I ever cut my locks? Hmm. I 
debate about this a lot. If you followed me for a while or if you're any of family or friends who watch this video, you know that I speak about wanting to cut my locks a lot. Right now, I trim them because they used to be to my buttocks. That's how long they were. And then now they're a little past my bra strap. Putting the scissor next to it freaks me out. But I'm pretty sure one day I will cut my locks. I'm pretty sure about that. The question is when? Do you plan on having kids and will they have locks? Yes, I plan on having a child. And no, I will not. Um, well, it depends. They will have to make that decision. I won't force locks upon my child. I mean, I love this community that I'm a part of. I'm an advocate for it, but I won't force any loved one, any loved one to have locks, if that makes sense. They would have to make that decision on their own because like I always preach to you guys all the time, having locks is a commitment. My child. I just, don't I see a lot of you guys like send me comments on Instagram and whatnot and say, oh your children will look great. Don't don't speak that upon my life. Speak child, kid, one. I was also asked how can I control frizz? I have a video coming out to help you with that. Um, so be on the lookout for that. Uh somebody said you talked about in your last video with the ugly stage that you never went through that. So can you please um state what happened like why didn't you go through that i didn't go through that uh primarily because when i started my locks i started them off long they were not my hair has always been natural i never relaxed my hair so my hair was like naturally it was like around hair so i started with two stranded twists and then they just locked from there so yeah that's all the questions that i i'm received thus far if you have any more questions leave them below i will be sure to answer in the comment section below or i'll make a lock question and answer part two i like you i thank you guys so much for continually supporting your girl for subscribing to all my channels um speaking of channels i have a new channel dedicated just to beauty and lifestyle like some motivation beauty and motivation and this channel will be primarily to locks because i noticed a few of you guys don't really care about the makeup and the fashion that kind of hurts my feelings but you know i gotta cater to what you want and what you want is seeing all this hair all this lusciousness please subscribe to that channel also i have an important giveaway thank you for lasting all the way through because if you didn't then you wouldn't know what i am about to say um because i've been on youtube for a little while and i only now started to get serious about it um i want to thank you guys for that because of your motivation and your love and support of me made me push forward and do what i had to do so i want to send my appreciation out to you and almost like a late christmas gift for a lucky person um i will in this gift i will send you all my my top five my top five yeah top four or five lock hair essentials i will send you my shea butter i will also send you my bracelets and if i could get a bindi from nishkami I will send you that as well. And all you have to do is simply subscribe to my all three of my channels. Um, follow me on Instagram and Facebook and leave comments below as to what in 2017 will your goals be and what will you do differently than you did in 2016 that's it i will let this go for about two weeks so what's today's date today is the fourth so uh two weeks from now will be the 18th so it will go through till the 18th i will let the winners i will let you know who the winner is 
January 22nd and then I will send it out so yes I love you guys so much for watching once again I keep I know it's in my videos I keep saying this over and over again but I it's true I love you guys so freaking 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 much and I'll see you guys next time see you later Tiger Lilies toodles